We'll walk over to Jillian and show you what I'm talking about. Six, Come on. Seven, you don't want to do this. Eight, bring it straight up. One, don't bring it straight up. Two, bring it in the angle. Three, Think of my hand down in front of you like this. Bring it across. There you go. Just like that. That's it. Six, That's it. Seven, Come on, work it. I bring the elbow all the way across. Remember, resistance both ways. Resistance both ways. Push against the knee. Push with the elbow. I need one more set of these. Count it. That's it. Come on, work it. Work it. Last one, guys, go. I need you to hold on this one. Count it. Feel those abs. Feel those abs. Don't pull on your neck. We're going to hold on eight. Hold on eight. Hold on eight. Hold it. Yes, hold on eight. Hold on eight. Go the air out. Go the air out. Shouldn't be able to push. Shouldn't be able to push. Shouldn't be able to pull that shoulder apart. Hold it there. Yes, good job. All right. Bring it down. All right. Okay, now we're about to go down to the ground. When you go down to the ground, we're going to do strengthening exercise as well as making that stomach strong. Your back also will become strong. So take your right leg down. Right leg goes down here. Left leg goes down. Place your hands down here with both hands. Right leg goes out to the side. Left leg goes down on top. Place all the weight on your left Right elbow, other hand goes here on top. Right, left leg goes up first. You're lift it up to the side. You're going to lift one at the same time. Now, as you do this, what the armpit doing? Armpit is going into the thigh. Armpit is going into the thigh. That's it. Come on. One more set. Lift. Remember, you see me. I'm not pulling on my neck. You don't want to pull on your neck. Leave the hand on the side of your head. You really, really want to country on your left side of your ass. You feel a little bit in your back. But that doesn't mean you're hurting yourself. You're working a muscle that you never worked before. Come on. Count it. Now pick your heel up. The heel goes up. The heel, not the toe. Now, now both legs go up. Both legs go up. That's it. Good job. Way to work it. Come on. Now lift that leg straight up in the air. Straight up in the air. That's it. Come on. Now, sometimes you have to have the leg fully extended. You can just pull those legs in a little bit. Pull them in a little more. And re remember, when you're doing a side ab, rock back on your butt cheek. You don't want to be laying on your hip bone. Lay on your butt cheek where you have some meat and some cushion. One more set. Ready? Lift it straight up. That's it. There you go. Come on. Good job. Yes. All right. Now pivot to the front side like this. Hold this position here. Now you're going to lift your right leg up and left leg here. Now don't fully extend the legs. Drop the knee. The knee. Remember, the bottom of the knee goes to the... Carpet. That's it, right to the floor. There you go. Good job. Come on. Work it. Work it. Come on. Work it. Work it. One more set. Go. Now drop those elbows down so you don't feel any pressure in your back. And round your back. Remember, when you're doing a leg lift, you got to round your back. Tuck your chin in. You don't want your chin sticking up. Chin should be tucked into your chest. Tuck it in. One more set. Go. See, not a straight leg. Push your knee down to the floor. Lift the knee up to the ceiling. Now that's all air. Round your back. Now remember, if you feel it in your back still, come up a little higher. There you go. Work it. One more time. Go. Count it. Work those abs. Come on. Count it. Count it. Good job. Slide over to the right side. Good job. All right, now we got your left elbow down. Be up underneath the shoulder blade. All right, place your right hand on top of the head. Base line front. Lift up your right heel. Let's go. Lift the heel. Lift the heel. That's it. Lift the heel, heel, lift the heel, lift the heel, lift the heel, the heel is coming up, and bring the armpit, the armpit goes into the heel, right into the thigh here, and the thigh goes into the armpit, one more time, lift it up, lift it up, two, little pressure, that's it, there you go, push it, see I'm resisting, making a resist, there you go, both legs up, go. Both legs up. Remember, the legs don't have to be out so far. Bring those legs in a little bit closer. There you go, right there. Now you got it. Now you in the groove. Way to work it. There you go. Come on, you're doing a good job. One more set, go. That's it. Work it, guys. Good job. Come on. Work those abs. Work those abs. Work those abs. Come on. Good job. Bring it back. Bring it back across the line right here. Now again, we're going to lay down. Lock. Listen, guys, when people do stomach crunches, sometimes they have a tendency to lay the whole back on the floor. When you lay your whole back on the floor, you have a tendency to round your back, and you swing. Once you do is put your back on the floor. Everybody do this right now. Put your hands in the air. You guys at home, put your hands in the air. Place your fingers on your abs. Your abs are tight. Your abs are soft right now, right? 
Okay, now lift your chin up, pull it to your right to your chest, shoulders off the ground. Now the abs should be contracted right now. Everybody's abs contracted? Yes, sir. Okay, now hands out in front. Now you're gonna go up. Now shoulder blades don't touch. You gotta do this. Count it. Everybody count. That's it. Now shoulder blades don't touch. You're doing a good job right now. Remember, your head is so far away from the center part of your body. Every time you do a sit-up or any type of nap exercise, it's going to cause a reaction in your neck. But that doesn't mean that you're pulling a muscle. That means your neck has to get used to Your body has to get used to picking up your head. And this position is the only time that your body really picks up your head. So you got to work on it. And the more you strengthen your neck from doing this exercise, the more that neck starts to go away. Count it. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Feel the burn. Yes. Feel the burn. One more. Count it. That's it. How you guys feel out there? Come on. One more time, go. Count it, count it, yes. Count it, count it. Now hold it up there, hold it, now hold it. Now blow all the air out of your stomach, right now. Blow all the air out of your stomach. All the air should be out of your stomach. Now hold it right there, so you're feeling that burn now. Now start from right there, now go up from there. Don't go lower, but go up higher, come on. Count it, count it. Now, now you really got them abs contracted. See the, the shoulder blades not touching the ground anymore. You're not stretching. You're doing a good ab workout. I guarantee you, after this ab workout, your stomach gonna feel like a rubber band. That's what you want. All you in at home that got the lower stomach problems, watch and see what happens. You're gonna start pulling that stomach up. It's gonna snap tight the way you wanna make it snap tight. All right, keep it up. Come on, count it, count it, count it, count it, count it, count it. Good job. Give me a stretch. Give me a nice stretch. Here's a good way to stretch it out. You know, you do abs. You wanna get a nice stretch at the same time. Stretch out here. Six. One more time. Go. That's it. Count it. All right. Good job. Now, bring it up. Place your hands on the side. Now, place your leg go to the side. Take your left leg to the side. Take your right leg. Place it on top of the left knee. Just like this. Okay? Put the left leg in. Place the fist on the side of your head. Then take your elbow over. Touch. That's it. Now, remember, those at home that can't do this exercise, just keep your left leg bent and bring it over. Or bring the right leg up by itself. Okay, then once you become stronger, then attach both of them to each other, and then you'll get the same type of workout you've seen everybody else do out here. You might see some of these guys modify a little bit. That's okay. Go ahead and modify it enough where you still can get strong and be strong, okay? Come on, count it, guys. Count it. Squeeze those abs. Squeeze. Squeeze. Now the same thing, resistance. I'm pushing against her legs. They're gonna pick those legs up. Pushing against her elbows. Push. Now she's working on just the left side by itself. Left side by itself. That's it. Good job. Now switch over to the other side. Let's go back to the other side. You guys are doing a good job. Doing a good job out there, guys. Okay, here we go. Left leg going on top of the right. Pull the right leg back. Place the right fist up. Now you're gonna lift, lift. Lift it up. Shoot, lift. Can't hear you count. Three, Let me hear you count. Four, now, sometimes we're gonna do it like this. I might say pick it up a little bit, okay? If I say double, you don't wanna swing it. You wanna pick it up and you wanna do this. Watch Julianne. Shall I still keep the pace? But watch Julianne. I'm gonna have her double, double, four, double. You see what she's doing here? She's not losing that contraction. Every once in a while, go ahead and do that while you're doing a workout. Go into that double mode and then you really feel the burn there, okay? But right now, go back to the stretch. Go back to the stretch. That's it. Good way to start it. Yes. Good job. All right. Bring it back to the front. All right. Here we go. Now cross your legs. Lift the knees up here. Place the fingertips on the side of the head. Don't grab. Don't cup your hands. Put them behind your neck. Put them on the side of your head. Now the elbows go up. Touch. Touch. Touch the outside of the knees. But don't please don't pull on your neck. You don't want to pull on your neck. Keep those fingertips on the side. Train yourself to put those fingertips on the side of your head. Count it. Come on. Again, count it, count it, count it, count it. Now slow it down, go one, two, down easy. Yeah, I like the slow stuff first. And then after we do the slow stuff, we get right into the fast stuff. But right now, I'm just concentrating, feel the burn, feel the contraction. Now remember, pull those elbows in. You want to squeeze those abs like you did the standing abs. You want to pull those legs in and squeeze those abs. Come on, there you go. Come on, guys. Count it, count it, count it, count it, count it, that's it, come on, one more, good job, place your hands down, 
Place your hands up to the ceiling. Here's a good way to do your abs all the way up now. I want your knee to come up. Both knees come into the middle part of your body. Palms touch the ground. You go one, back down. Look what I'm doing here, guys. Shoulders off, shoulders off the ground. Shoulders off the ground. One, touch. Shoulders don't touch. We'll walk on the show you, show you what I'm talking about. If I put my hands underneath her like this, see, my shoulders are not touching the ground. The back is round, the stomach's contracted. The stomach is contracted. Remember, the stomach is contracted. Now, watch Shelly. Most people do this. Straighten out your back, Shelly. They straighten it back out, then all of a sudden the neck pull starts to come in, and the back ache starts to come in. Around your back. Around the back. There you go, just like that. Okay? Give me one more set, please. Count it. I'm gonna stick my hand up underneath your back. All right, now, come on, try it. Put my hand up underneath your back. Keep the back round. Count it. That's it. Count it. Count it. When you start to give up, guys, count out loud. Force yourself to do what you want, don't want to do. That's it. Good job. All right, now let's take it into a, a little bit of a bicycle. A little bit of a bicycle. Are you ready? Place it here. Hands up to the side. Bicycle. Go. One, two. Nice and easy. Come on. Keep moving. Come on. Let's go. Keep on moving. That's it. Keep moving. Move that stomach. Come on. Back and forth. There you go. Work those abs. Make it burn. AJ, what you doing over here? What you doing over here? Come on. Let me see it. Let me work. Count it. Count it. Let's go. Count it. Make it burn. That's it. Count it. Count it. Yes. One more set, guys. Count it. Count it. Count it. All right. Good job. Okay. Here we go. Here's a new one. Arms are up. Keep your arms up here. Now we're going to give a stretch and a sit up at the same time. Watch me first, then you guys will try it. One, open the legs up. Give me a nice. See my shoulders don't touch the ground. Shoulders are off the ground. Touch. Back down. Ready? Place your hands up. Everybody count on with me. We go. One, back down. Two, watch your back. Shoulders are off the ground. I can't hear you guys count. I can't hear y'all count. Come on. There you go. Count it out. Let's go. Come on, guys. Count it. Let me see you do it. Let me see you do it. There you go. Count it out. Let me hear you guys count it out. I can't hear y'all. I think it's going to be push-ups time if y'all start counting out. I think it's going to be push-ups time. Don't force me to make y'all do 100 push-ups. If y'all want to do 100 push-ups, then I can't hear you. You got to sound off. I still can't hear you. What are you doing at home? Are you sounding off? Good job. Come on. All right. Bring it down. That was good. Okay, bring it up. Put your left leg, right leg in, left leg in. Here's another good one for the lower stomach. Lower stomach, place your hands here, pick the legs up. Now let's do this. One, two, pump it in, pump it in, pump, pump it in, that's it. Remember, don't pull on your neck, don't put your hands on your neck, keep the hands on the floor. Once you get a little advanced, then you can't put your hands on your neck. Right now, so you keep your hands down. Four, five, six, one more set, go, count it, good, come on, work it, and drop it down, good. Hold it right there, keep the hands here. We're gonna finish up with some power, some power abs right now. Are y'all ready? Okay, left leg goes up. Now remember this, when you do this exercise, you're gonna feel a little bit in your back, because right now your back might not be used, used to this exercise. So let me tell you, let's make sure when you guys do this exercise, you wanna keep the back round. It's very important that you keep your back round. Anytime you're doing the abdomen exercise, you wanna keep your back round. If you wanna tighten those abs up, don't straighten the back all the way out, because if you do, you're gonna, all you're gonna do is stretch your abs, and then when you relax your stomach, it's gonna hang. Keep it in a relaxed mode. I mean, keep it in a round mode. And you keep it to that position. And then all of a sudden, when you stand up straight, the abs go boom. They pull tight, okay? That's what we're doing with the contraction. So lift that leg up, straighten your leg out. Now put the other leg up, straighten your leg out. Now, round your back. Roll back. Now slightly, if you have to bend the knees, bend the knees. You want to hold it. Put your hands up now. Now you should be on your, your butt cheeks. Round your back, you round the butt cheeks. Now you're gonna feel a little bit in your quadriceps too. That's okay, but well, that's the way we gotta start. Come on, now remember, if you have to drop your leg down, go ahead and drop it down. But when you start to feel the pain a little bit, start to count out louder, scream. And then if you have to rest, go ahead and rest, and then come back and do it over again, okay? Don't quit, don't be a quitter, you can do this, come on. Count it, count it, count it, count it. One more set, go. Count it, count it, count it, count it, count it, count it, and drop your feet down. 
Good job. Now take the left leg over. Bring it over. Come on, guys, real fast. Hands are up. Reach out in front. Give me a nice stretch. Way over to the top. Count it. Count it. Good job. Walk your hands in. Pull your legs in. Take the right leg. Left leg, I'm sorry. Left leg. Pull it to the rear. Right leg is bent. Lean back. Give me a nice stretch on the abs. Rock back on your right elbow. Keep that knee down. You feel a little bit stretch in your abs here and your quads. Hold that stretch. Count it. Count it. Count it. Count it. That's it. All right. Now bring it up nice and easy. Push up off those arms. There you go. Switch your legs around. Stretch the right side abs out. Now reach back and grab the foot. Lay back on that elbow. Let this elbow hold you up. Keep this leg flat on the ground where you feel that stretch all across this area. Count it. That's it. Count it. There you go. Now bring it up. Bring both legs out in front. Take the right leg and cross your left leg. Right leg, cross the left leg. Put it across. Pull that left leg through and stand up. Good job. Good job.